Thank you for clicking on this video. I hope you guys are doing well today. Today's list is about nepotism in Bollywood. Nepotism is almost everywhere. Talk about Bollywood, Tollywood, politics, Hollywood, almost everywhere. Today I will talk about five actors who literally define nepotism in Bollywood. Well, I was really tempted to pick people like Ayush Sharma, Atya Shetty, Suresh Pancholi, but I don't think they have spent enough time in Bollywood to prove anything. On the other hand, people like Tiger Shroff, Alia Bhatt and Varun Dhawar are admirable to some extent that they don't look like they are taking place of someone deserving. This pick is based on their tenure, career graph and overall charisma. People like Uda Chopra, Harman Babeja and Fardeen Khan are excluded. And guys, if you like my work, please don't forget to subscribe and click on that bell icon to get regular updates. So without further ado, let's dive in. Number 5. Abhishek Bachchan I'm not saying that he cannot act, but if you look at the irrational times he has given chance to prove himself, it is clear that if it would have been someone else, I'm quite sure that person would have been seized from getting any type of role anymore. 18 years have elapsed since his debut in Refugee. His track record indicates a low average of successes and far too many duds, which has prevented Bachchan Jr. from ever making it to A-list. Honestly, I loved him in Refugee, but the performance performance was overshadowed by the launch of another celebrity son that year, Ritik Roshan. You could literally see that there is competition in nepotism also. Number 4. Bobby Dewa He made his Bollywood debut with Rajkumar Santoshi's Barsat in 1995 and this junior Dewa became an overnight star with debut hit film. Soon enough, he went on to sign innumerable films from love stories to gripping thrillers to action years. Bobby Dewa experimented with different genres in the first few years of his career. But with passing years and the entry of new crop of actors, Bobby's stardom slowly began to fade away. The 49-year-old actor reveals that his shortcomings to keep up with the change changing time led his gradual disappearance from the films. He said, I guess I was too old fashioned, couldn't keep up with the quickly changing times. I didn't even realize when my career started slipping away. Okay, I feel bad for him, but at the same time there were people like Anurag Kashyap who were making films on rented camera and actors like Nawazuddin Siddiqui who was working as security guard and doing theaters. So I don't know how much support somebody needs. Number 3. Jackie Bagnani he made his Bollywood debut in 2009 with Kal Kisne Deka, which I'm quite sure you don't know anything about and is still waiting to strike gold. Initially, I was thinking, should I even pick him for this list? But then I realized that it has been 9 years since this actor is in Bollywood but has not done anything significant. Jackie is grateful that he hails from a filmy family and feels that perhaps this is one of the reasons why people haven't forgotten him as yet. Commenting on the same, he says, if I didn't belong to a filmy family, people would have forgotten me. I have to be in people's eye to even dislike or like me. I understand the context, but at the same time, I think about those struggling actors who could give their right hands to play protagonist in a Bollywood film. While well, Jackie is currently helping his father in handling the production of his company, as well making his debut in Tamil film industry. Number 2. Arshan Kapoor the most recent star kid to share his views on the topic is none other than actor Arjun Kapoor. Producer Boni Kapoor's son, Arjun who made his Bollywood debut in 2012 movie Isak Jade, reportedly feels that nepotism exists in every field. According to the actor, there are no degrees in the industry and everyone gets just one chance. He allegedly stated that the doors might have opened for him courtesy his dad. But after that, it was between his audience and him. He also added that no one buys a ticket or offers work because because of one surname. Well, you be the judge if that is true. But the kind of movies Arjun Kapoor does, I don't think he knows what is good cinema. Number 1. Sanjay Dutt You might be thinking why Sanjay Dutt is here. Well, I have few things to share why he might be the ultimate definition of nepotism in Bollywood. Okay, so unlikely other previous mentioned star kids, stardom was shoved under his throat. At least other people were serious and respectful with whatever they wanted to do. But Sanjay Dutt used to be under the influence of substance abuse while doing his debut movie. His father, the great Sunil Dutt, used to request him to focus and respect what he's getting. Well, if you don't believe me, you could even see this part in his so-called bio pick Sanju. To be honest, I don't have anything against him, but I feel really bad for hardworking people who are deprived and, and give their life to just get an even chance. Because all the chances 
are for kids who are born with silver spoon in their mouth. Also, I feel anyone with parents in an influential position will get an opportunity to join the same field. Parents would want to help their kids with their career and some of those kids would be generally talented, but at least understanding the value of that position is paramount. Well, that was the list guys. If you know any list worthy actor, please let me know in the comment section and thank you for watching. If you like this work, maybe you will like my other works also. Please don't forget to subscribe and see you guys in the next list. Till then, have a good one.